Hey y'all, welcome to my kitchen. I was born and raised in the South, in a city, and now I live in the Midwest on a farm, and I love it. Other things I love are Jesus, my family, and everything food. I'm so glad you decided to join me today. Hey y'all, I hope you're having a wonderful January. It has been unseasonably warm in Nebraska, and it was 50 degrees yesterday, gorgeous sunny, and today it's sunny, it's wonderful. And in a few days, we'll probably have a blizzard. But I love that about Nebraska because it's always so exciting. You never know what you're going to get. So today, I thought I would make a quick appetizer. This is an appetizer I made when the girls were little, and I used to bring it to parties, and I used to serve it at my house. And it was so fun, and it's super easy and really good. Four ingredients. Today, we're going to make bacon-wrapped water chestnuts. Let me show you what you'll need. Brown sugar, ketchup, water chestnuts, and bacon. Hey y'all, I'm so excited to make this and I want y'all to try this at home because it's a perfect kind of winter comfort food and it's fun to have new recipes in January. We actually have not celebrated Christmas yet with our kids. In fact, we're going to do it this weekend and so I'm very excited, but I still have all of my Christmas up. <laughs> I may do that next year. I may start just keeping my Christmas decorations up all of January. It's been so fun. It's a way to stretch it out. Jesus is the reason for every season. So there you go. Okay, so this recipe for bacon wrapped water chestnuts. You just use canned water chestnuts and ketchup, brown sugar, and bacon. That's it. Do y'all like water chestnuts? I love water chestnuts. I love the texture. I think it's fun. I love it in Asian food. I love it just by itself. So are y'all water chestnut fans? The first thing we're going to do is make our sauce. And so we just use one cup of brown sugar, a little snowman, even though it is far from snowy outside. <laughs> Got these from Madeline. Let's talk about ketchup a minute. Oh, this is a new one. <laughs> Let me get that off of there. Ooh. Okay. How many of you think you should refrigerate ketchup? And how many of you think you should not refrigerate ketchup? I would be curious to know. <laughs> I always keep ketchup out. I think the flavor is better and restaurants keep ketchup out. So what are your thoughts? <laughs> I'm gonna put this in my pantry, <laughs> not my fridge. So ketchup in with the brown sugar. And then you just stir it up. Do any of y'all keep your Christmas decorations up all of January or beyond? One of my daughters, beautiful, precious Savannah, she had a Christmas tree when she was a dental hygienist in Omaha and she kept it up all year round because she liked it. <laughs> I think she just had lights on there, but it was really pretty and I love that. I was like, oh, I could learn from that. <laughs> then you just open your bacon. I was talking this week to my sweet mother in love about bacon and she loves to fry her bacon and I love to do mine in the oven. How do you do your bacon? I've always foil lined my pan for doing this. So we're gonna do that. Ready. Be sure and drain your water chestnuts. Y'all knew that. <laughs> One thing I forgot to tell y'all that I just assume, never assume. <laughs> you also need toothpicks for this. <laughs> so don't forget your toothpicks. Okay, so you get your water chestnut and your piece of bacon. This is so fun. And then just wrap it around. So you can wrap it around just like this. Ooh. So great. You can wrap it around in one direction or you can wrap it around like a ball of yarn. Then you just get your toothpick and you put it through to fasten it. Make sure it goes through the other side so you'll see it, see? Perfect. Then you get your bowl of your brown sugar and ketchup and you dip it, dip, dip, dip. Ooh, that's fun. And put it in your foil lined pan. Mine is back here. <laughs> Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. Water chestnuts are super fun. See, I'll wrap one like this and you can see the difference. See, you just wrap it like that. <laughs> Get your toothpick. <laughs> I'm contaminating all my toothpicks with my sauce and so these toothpicks will have a one-time use. <laughs> Dip it in. Do y'all hear that cat? <laughs> I have my windows open. That's how warm it is today. <laughs> giddies. I love farm giddies. Now in the pan. I'm getting so excited about having the kids home to celebrate Christmas this weekend. And I can't wait. And I'm preparing my menus and 
our activities. It's gonna be so fun. I have plans to make gingerbread house pieces for all of them to make, of course, because that is our tradition. <laughs> These are gonna go into a 400 degree oven for one hour and then let's dance. just took these out and my kitchen smells divine. Can't wait to feed these to Rick and of course eat them myself. Y'all thanks so much for cooking with me today and making some bacon wrapped water chestnuts. I hope you're enjoying your weather whatever it is. My sweet and precious children Savannah and Miles are snowed in in Connecticut today so they'll be having a snow shoveling party. I wish I were there doing it with them. It sounds super fun and I love to shovel snow. Do y'all like to shovel snow? I love to. It's like one of my favorite things. Y'all have a great week. Don't forget to thank Jesus and enjoy. See you next time.